Oh, I got that right. What gamers do we have in chat? Let's find out. We have many a gamer. Check. How do we check? Uh, I know, just look at chat, I guess. Okay, there's like a thing. Oh. We'll find out later. Hello to all you gamers in chat. Big gamers. We have a likes in chat. Of course we do. Eventually, hopefully we'll be... South Australia could be the first major at this rate. So hopefully we can see many of the national gamers come down. Maybe in a few years, Big Cheese becomes the Australia's bit premier event. We can see some international gamers come down to our little humble abode. That would be brilliant. That'd be so I'd sick. Love I love South Australia's melee scene. It's, re it's, it's art. It's great. It's so good. It's so tight as well. It is. It's great. No matter if I kick Muscat's ass or if he kicks my ass, we're all going out to dinner at the end of the night. One of us will be salty, but Where are we going to dinner? Me. I don't know. We're going to have to figure it out. Yeah. Well, a I think a lot of places either aren't going to be open or they're going to have, like, well, it costs uh, yeah. an absorb, like, a ridiculous amount of money. I think we're thinking, like, Guzman's. Or Guzman. I might get, like, Indian or something. Else. Yeah. I'm down with anything, but... Yeah. We'll figure out something, I'm sure. Yeah, that's the way we uh we deal with tilt in South Australia. We just we all get uh oh. greasy food after melee. I love the love the little static as I hear Peach down smash on these headphones. It's the little things. It's the little things. Oh, having a stream back, having a real tournament, I love this. It's, it's fantastic. I love commentating. Thank you all for watching as well. This is great. Happy to have you all here. Thank you uh, for fiction. Let's go. I wonder Already. if there are any fiction gamers. Any fiction gamers still on chat? Let us know. But we have Catherine B. Muscat. Catherine with like five bears. I don't use that move enough, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, that's so good. The way it Catherine uses it and the way Armada uses it, I just don't. Mm. I will, I'll learn that. Work in progress. Oh! Muscat looking a little bit shaky. Catherine taking the first 70% doesn't get the follow up though. Covered nothing. Like if he, oh. if he, if he DI'd if he, if he just takes in place or DI'd out, take to L, she wouldn't have covered that either. Oh! oh. <laughs> Catherine with the most insane edge guard. Oh, Muscat holding down for it, no yeah. reason. This is looking like a McCallum Cloud Knight. I don't think I don't know about you guys. <laughs> I'm feeling good. <laughs> Catherine will learn the SDI up at some point. Probably not. She'll never learn it. Oh, maybe, maybe. Catherine's been getting a, getting a lot recently. Ooh. Wow, Vortex. 72 it's with the catches bear? him getting greedy. Muscat may have underestimated his own sister somehow. I don't know how that works. 73% are. Oh. Don't know. Muscat's very good from the ledge here, but an option that doesn't feel important. Well, that's, that, that's probably going to be it, right? Oh, oh he, he goes almost high. went all the way out. Ooh, if she just went out and fed. But she didn't trust herself. She didn't know. Oh, that, that, that was almost a sub point, actually. Probably not, though. She doesn't trust those ones. Kath always had really fast point error. Like that. Yeah. Like, she just acts really fast out of shield or something. I just, like, couldn't for the longest time. Like, damn, Kath. Oh, what the oh. fuck, dude? Okay. Yes, yes. I was about to say, if he actually lived Wait, there. how the hell did we start Stadium? Yeah. I'm gonna have to sit Catherine down and we're gonna I, explain. Yeah, I said before, Catherine <laughs> likes Stadium. I don't. Why are we on Stadium? Why, why did we start Falco and Yoshi's? What is happening? <laughs> My mind going blank. But you know what? She's winning, so she's like, I don't know if it works, dude. It's just Big Brian. I'm just imagining Muscat. Maybe it's a mind game thing where like oh, I have to play my sister. I've always been with my sister, and like you know, like she picked me to stay and free, free as hell. And Catherine just like hit, hit, hit. <laughs> <laughs> I've been practicing this for years. <laughs> oh, cover straight again. Oh, Muscat goes low. Not the best recovery so far. Everyone looking shaky except your boy. I will say, boy feeling good. <laughs> Catherine also looking good. Actually, Catherine, Catherine looking really, like, her neutral's been really solid, and, like, her pits have just been, like, relatively clean. Like, not nothing, like, insane, but just, like, good, clean pull-ups and edge balls and balls. Mm. Alright, last stop, game one. Can literally be anyone's. I mean, Catherine's yeah, playing I really well. Yeah, I could win well. this game, you could win this game. <laughs> I could win this game, could be anyone. It could be Milo. Could be Milo. Milo could just be winning this game right now. 
I feel oh no. So in South Australia, for any of the fiction games of gaming watching, we actually have a tag rule. To where like at any point in the set you get one a tournament where you can just yell tag and then like the game will pause and then you can swap players. <laughs> <laughs> well you're only allowed to wobble if your parents are in the crowd. Yeah. Yeah. If your parents are in the crowd that you can wobble. These are just Australian rules, by the way. But we also use Frozen Stadium, so you know we're ahead of something. Oh, close there it is. Game very, one. very close. Muscat clutching it out, though. Muscat breathing a sigh of relief. Now, when I say a sigh of relief, I mean a big ass head shake. And, <laughs> and a gulp of, I don't know, it's fucking almond milk. Let's go. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> coconut milk? Coconut I think he's, I th yeah, I think it might be like coconut water. Oh, coconut water, I think. Uh. Which Muscat told me for the spice. He's a spice grinder, so he just like. He just like buys random things that are spicy or like goes out to random places that are spicy and tries to eat them. Really? He's, monster, yeah. he's just living that thrill seeking life. I don't know. He's crazy. Because he's not doing it in melee. I've seen his gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> I know he'd be shit talking me if he was on the mic. Like, yeah. <laughs> we all love each other. Can't wait for him to watch us back. <laughs> there's such a. Uh, yeah, there's like a big difference between like. We're friends and I'm going to shit talk you and then just like yeah. vehemently not liking someone. And in South Australia, such a tight community, I think a lot of people just... Yeah, I think everyone's good. Everyone yeah. knows. We've, ha we've been to enough like 10 p.m. like fucking game 10s. We're like, yeah, we're still here, guys. Can we just go to dinner? One of you win. <laughs> oh, what the... I I've made that mistake a million times. She just thought she was going to grab ledge and she oh. didn't. And she was like, oh, and she realized too late. Oh, is that a su I swear to God, she's double jumping. Is she? Has Catherine been on like the weirdest practice grind? She needs to grind that SDI. That's a can't be taking 50% off grab. That was a option, I will say. Maybe it was an, maybe it was a tented wave dash. Maybe it was many things. Fox broken. That's all. Fox unfair. That was second hit too. No way out. Maybe an edel. Muscat just getting a little bit paid. Damn. Like if Damn. you want. Damn. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. This, this is what we expected game one to look like, by the way. Oh, this is, this is the best of five. Yeah. Um, but Catherine's got loads of time to make this bad. She does. But I think what you watch between this game and game one is Muscat will just like add little pauses. Whereas like game one, he'd just like run at her and try to do a move. And Catherine would just have the fucking butt in her face. And now he'll just like stop. Catherine will put her butt out and then Muscat will do yeah. that. And she'll do that. So like, Muscat adapting. Learning a lot. I mean, it's really yeah. unfortunate that he had to learn this lesson before he played me, but we'll see. <laughs> well, we're going on to game three. Catherine, probably going back to mountain. She loves mountain. Yeah. Like Catherine, Catherine stage picks her in an acre. She'll like lose. Yeah. She got three stock, but you know what? Not back. I don't disagree. I don't think FD is particularly good. Yeah, Muscat just like finally fishing her out there. Just being like, it's just the tiniest bits of patience give you so much value in this game. Yeah, see? Just wait, instead of rushing. Oh. Such a meaty. Oh, there we go. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Oh, wow. hold it out. Good yeah. stuff, Catherine. Muscat going high one too many times. Those cool outs give her so much. Like when she, she's been doing them throughout the set. And I think she just has to do it more. She's never done, like she's been, like she's literally famous in South Australia. Like both Muscats were, but like famous for just like not edge guarding and just like doing nothing, pulling turns. I'm really impressed with this Catherine this time. Unfortunately, no Caleb to beat for Catherine today, but I guess she'll settle for Kai. And is Caleb not here? Unfortunately not. Yeah. His brother is though. Yeah. For the first time in oh, like two years. Yeah. <laughs> like, very exciting. Oh, Muscat with a high side B for the 50th oh. time. Catherine yeah. just needed to yeah. grab that to oh. Oh. He gets back on stage. That was just good SDI. Yeah. Muscat's really good at um like uh, SDIing into the stage and then he SDIs down. Uh, so he lands. Mm. So it's really hard to aerial him after the dab, depending on if he gets it. Yeah, Muscat's defensive play really good. Muscat's just really good against Peach. Like, no Who would have thought? I know, no, right? Uh, Sister's Peach, main practice partner's Peach. Crazy. This game was looking a lot closer, but two stocks. Really good. That, if that 18% 18, 18 stock didn't happen, then maybe. But a little bit of a greeny down smash. Can't say I haven't done that before. 
Like, when, when Musket makes the mistakes there, like Shining of Flames, those are the kind of, like, mistakes you just have to kill them for. Mm. And, like, Catherine's just not quite at that level, but really good dare grab. Runs all the way into the corner, too. Unfortunately, he doesn't get the take this. Shining's back on stage. Hits him with the big fish. You're gonna oh, pull it out. I was expecting, oh. I was, I was expecting the jump turn up throw to catch the, uh, the higher B, but... I was expecting her to just fair. That, would that, yeah. you reckon that would've that hit? Too. Yeah. But not, the confidence not right there. There we go. That's gonna be death. The tenth fucking what? high side B in this set. I think Muscat's just turned his brain off at this point. He's just like, he'll die eventually. He'll die eventually. It's fine. I got two. I took. I got two more games. What's Catherine gonna do, baby? Would it be? You reckon it would have been better to back throw there instead of forward throw? Uh, for Cath? Yeah. It depends. Up throw is really good too. I'd probably up throw there to be honest. Now you get a play tech face. Catherine uh, not quite. Ah, uh, there it is. Three zero by Muscat. Are we running winners or are we running losers? I assume we're doing some losers. All right, excellent. We what have are losers we quarters. We have losers is that, quarters. Who, what's the game? Oh, sick. 